Hello friends. You all must have experienced the sound of railway engine siren piercing through your ears when it's approaching towards you. But it decreases sharply as soon as it moves away from you. Now the question is, is the sound getting any louder? Well, let's understand. Sound as you know is a wave. It has amplitude and frequency. I'm standing on a platform and I could hear the whistle of the engine standing near me. Now let's see its intensity and frequency. Now the decibels here shows its intensity and the frequency is measured in hertz. Now what happens when the engine starts moving towards me. You see that? With the decibel levels remaining the same, the frequency has increased. Now, what if the train moves away? Now again, as you see, the decibel levels remain the same, but the frequency has sharply reduced. So what irritates you when the train moves towards you is not its loudness but its frequency. So it is the frequency that gets altered when the source of the sound moves. Now this effect is called the Doppler effect. When the source of sound moved towards me, the number of waves produced by the engine got crammed up in a lesser distance. This increase the frequency of the waves. Now when the train moved away from me, the same number of waves got spread out, thus decreasing the frequency. Now it is because of this difference that we feel that the sound has decreased sharply when the source comes closer and away from us. By measuring the shift in frequency, we can determine an object's velocity. Hence, there are various applications that use Doppler effect to its advantage, such as determining the speed of a moving vehicle like a car. It is used in radar to detect speed of moving objects like aeroplanes and jets. It is used in ultrasonic flow meter in industrial application to determine the flow rate of liquid. And the same technique is used in determining blood flow through arteries. For more such fantastic videos, Follow Top Scholars.